Wrong does not cease to be wrong because the majority share in it. As long as there are slaughterhouses, there will always be battlefields. A battle is won by him who is firmly resolved to win it. If everyone fought for their own convictions, there would be no war. Every lie is a poison. There are no harmless lies. Only the truth is safe. Only the truth gives me consolation. It is the one unbreakable diamond. Be bad, but at least don't be a liar, a deceiver. Historians are like deaf people who go on answering questions that no one has asked them. And not only the pride of intellect, but the stupidity of intellect. And, above all, the dishonesty, yes, the dishonesty of intellect. Yes, indeed, the dishonesty and trickery of intellect. The pleasure lies not in discovering truth, but in searching for it. Every man and every living creature has a sacred right to the gladness of springtime. There is something in the human spirit that will survive and prevail. There is a tiny and brilliant light burning in the heart of man that will not go out no matter how dark the world becomes. Life is too long to say anything definitely, always say perhaps. You can love a person dear to you with a human love, but an enemy can only be loved with divine love. All the variety, all the charm, all the beauty of life is made up of light and shadow. Love. The reason I dislike that word is that it means too much for me, far more than you can understand. I think, if it is true that there are as many minds as there are heads, then there are as many kinds of love as there are hearts. It's hard to love a woman and do anything. I always loved you. And if one loves anyone, one loves the whole person, just as they are and not as one would like them to be. We are asleep until we fall in love. Not one word, not one gesture of yours shall I, could I, ever forget. It is amazing how complete is the delusion that beauty is goodness. If you look for perfection, you'll never be content. Seize the moments of happiness, love, and be loved. That is the only reality in the world. All else is folly. It is the one thing we are interested in here. Why are you so sad? Because you speak to me in words, and I look at you with feelings. Whatever our fate is or may be, we have made it and do not complain of it. Pure and complete sorrow is as impossible as pure and complete joy. There is no greatness where there is not simplicity, goodness, and truth. Music is the shorthand of emotion. Respect was invented to cover the empty place where love should be. 
It's much better to do good in a way that no one knows anything about it. The best stories don't come from good vs bad, but good vs good. Happiness does not depend on outward things, but on the way we see them. I often think that men don't understand what is noble and what is ignorant, though they always talk about it. Mohammed has always been standing higher than the Christianity. He does not consider God as a human being and never makes himself equal to God. Muslims worship nothing except God and Mohammed is his messenger. There is no any mystery and secret in it. Free thinkers are those who are willing to use their minds without prejudice and without fearing to understand things that clash with their own customs, privileges, or beliefs. This state of mind is not common, but it is essential for right thinking. Man cannot possess anything as long as he fears death. But to him who does not fear it, everything belongs. If there was no suffering, man would not know his limits, would not know himself. To tell the truth is very difficult, and young people are rarely capable of it. And you know, there's less charm in life when you think about death, but it's more peaceful. Here I am alive, and it's not my fault, so I have to try and get by as best I can without hurting anybody until death takes over. One can live magnificently in this world if one knows how to work and how to love. It's too easy to criticize a man when he's out of favor and to make him shoulder the blame for everybody else's mistakes. All great literature is one of two stories. A man goes on a journey or a stranger comes to town. Instead of going to Paris to attend lectures, go to the public library and you won't come out for 20 years if you really wish to learn. Something magical has happened to me, like a dream when one feels frightened and creepy and suddenly wakes up to the knowledge that no such terrors exist. I have wakened up.